All right, guys, we're over at the cabin tonight. We're cooking on the uh, rocket stove. This is the Silver Fire rocket stove and the Silver Fire dragon pot. I put water in the dragon pot from the Lex Pure inside and some of our fresh potatoes. Two of the biggest fresh potatoes we dug. I sliced them in half and turned them over and put them in there and let them steam. So I'm going to be feeding this for a little while. When the potatoes get reasonably done, I have some of our wax beans. I'm going to throw them in there and let them steam for a little bit while Danny puts some steaks on the grill. We have meat that we um, bought a half a cow this past week. So we have a steak. You're going to be cooking, right? I suppose. All right, I've got quite a fire going here. The water's already boiling. It's already steaming. I don't want to let my steam out. Let's see, it's fogging up. This little um, dragon pot is awesome the way it's made. It cooks really, really well. And it takes just a few sticks. I've just got these few laying here. We're going to see if our potatoes and beans get done with just these few sticks. All right, guys. I just checked the potatoes before it will go through them. Danny said it's been 40 minutes. And I'm fixing to add the beans. He's fixing to start the grill. And I'm just going to throw my beans around on top. We're going to let the beans steam for a little bit. Mr. Danny is fixing to start the steaks. Isn't that gorgeous? We're going to see how well he cooks our steaks. He is our master steak cooker, huh? Steak connoisseur. And those few sticks that I had laying here, we're down to one tiny one and one big one, and we're about done. The beans should be done shortly. It doesn't take long for beans to steam, and the steam is crazy there. It's messing the camera up. The beans are turning a glossy looking color. It's pretty awesome. The dragon pot is great to cook things outdoors. Danny's not so bad with the steaks either. They're coming on. Not time to turn yet. Looks like they get in there. Yeah, this one that likes her is a little overdone. Looks like it's getting perfect. All right, we're down to a few coals. How long did it take? Oh, uh, 55 minutes now. Almost an hour. Steam coming out. The potatoes are done. The green beans are done. I just checked them. Silver, fire, rocket stove, and dragon pot. Awesome way to cook. Mine's probably got to cook a little longer. Yours is probably about done. Yeah, mine's about done. I'm gonna put the bone part over the flame and let the meat just kinda... Yours I can kick up a little bit right here. All right, guys, so we're fixing to eat. Have our steak, our potato, 
and our beans. And this is the way you steam a baked potato, right? Yep. Looks so, like it's going to be a good meal here. Let me try my... What do you think about the green bean? Oh, they're good. What do you think? Ah. Uh, Steamed green beans. That's, that's eaten. That's the way to do it, isn't it? Yep. Okay, that is so the way. we have butter from our canned butter. Where I canned butter, I bring it over here for us to have. And it's just melting on my potato. So what you think? Steak's got a really good taste. I haven't got to it yet. Mm. The potato is good and tender. Mm. Oh, it's melting your mouth. Yeah, see, I even put butter on my steak. Well, I'm missing out. I need the knife. Well, I just cut a little tiny piece off here. Right? We're having to share a knife. I have another one, but... Mmm. That's pretty awesome. Did I get yours right? Oh yeah. It's done, but it's not overdone. Right. It's still tender. At least there's no red stuff in it. You know, that's what I don't want. Yeah, you know, Wanda, Wanda can't handle the red stuff. Oh, guys. Me, I don't care. Off-grid eating at its finest. Yeah. The potato. Mm. That potato. Is a fresh potato we harvested last night. Last night? Oh my gosh. That is fine. The green beans were harvested this morning. Mm. And, uh. Man. You can't get any better than fresh. We eat like kings. We do. Let's go, we are kings. We are. And this, this meat, guys. Mm. It's good. That potato's just fine. I think potato's the best, isn't it? Mm. I don't know. The beans are a close second. Yeah, the beans are pretty good. Mm. I'm a big time meat eater, so. So guys, this is our off-grid meal for tonight. Here at the off grid cabin. Yep. And the silver fire rocket stove is a hit with the dragon pot. We love it. Mm. We like our Alexa Pure because it gives us our water. And Danny's just gotta just get over there and just enjoy a little bit. Have I don't think y'all need to see him just ooze all over his food. I love good food. And this is good food. And this is good food. Not because we cooked it. It's just good food. You like that it? little bit of crisp on the fat. Yeah. Oh my gosh. I love it. I mean, I love it. Really, I do. I... It's just good meat. That's good, fresh, good, fresh beef. So thank you guys for joining us here at the Off Grid Cabin for another fine meal. Fresh from the garden. Uh -huh, from the garden. To cooked, cooked outside, didn't cost us anything, just a few little sticks. Of course, Danny used a little gas on the grill, but thank you guys from Crazy Days.